Well, take a listen to that. That's the sound coming from the Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco as the bomb cyclone hits the West Coast, bringing gale force winds. That whistling could be heard for miles. Meantime, here in Washington, two people have been killed due to that massive storm hitting Seattle. In California, excessive rain is causing mudslides in the areas hit hard by wildfires. Now, in some places on the coast, 10 inches of rain have fallen just in the last 24 hours. Tonight, David Begno shows us the damage. It has been a monster storm, uprooting trees, flooding rivers in Northern California, and turning creeks into mud-filled rivers. In San Rafael, just north of San Francisco, there were more than 300 calls for help from fire or police. That's four times what it is normally. Across the region, officials say they may not know the full extent of the damage in those burn areas until later today. With the rains and winds coming through, it's kind of, it's, it's, um, anyone's guess on what's going to occur. Now look at this. That big truck was almost pushed over by strong winds on a bridge just north of San Francisco. And on the world famous Golden Gate Bridge, gale force winds actually caused vibrations that created this eerie whistle that you could apparently hear for miles. Listen. Farther inland, a substantial landslide shut down this major highway in the same area as this summer's massive Dixie fire that happened just north of Sacramento. Closer to Sacramento in the town of Carmichael, there were roads underwater as of late Sunday. More than five inches of rain fell in California's state capital, breaking the previous record that was set back in 1880. Meanwhile, up in Washington state, this road east of Seattle was closed after a tree fell and crushed a vehicle, killing two people. All I can think about right now are their families something like so random. It's just awful. David Begno, CBS News.